see weather in the forecast tomorrow morning. The skies are expected to clear up just in time for the Hartford's St. Patrick's Day Parade. We got the luck of the Irish on our side, <laughs> right? Parade organizers say as of now, they're planning to kick things off as planned at 11.15. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Mike Cerullo is live in Hartford with what you need to know if you're planning to go. Mike. Well, parade organizers say rain, snow, or sunshine. They are a go for tomorrow. As of now, they're expecting thousands of people to come out to the parade in downtown Hartford. They're going to be lining the streets here along the parade route. They are expecting thousands of people to be watching those bands, the dancers, and the floats make their way down the parade route. And, of course, all of those people will need somewhere to park. Now, I just checked in with the city, and they say, as of now, they're not considering a parking ban at the moment. But if one does take effect and things do change, Parade organizers say that will only affect city streets. They say Laz and Pro Park lots will be cleared out in plenty of time to get to the parade. Businesses on Pratt Street are looking forward to the crowds. I stopped by Vaughn's public house earlier in the day. A manager there tells me as long as the parade doesn't get canceled, she's expecting people to start lining up out, outside the pub as early as 7.30 tomorrow. It's warm in here. Um, we'll have tents and heaters outside. We'll have bars set up outside. Um, you know, if it's a little, little snowy in the morning, it'll just be pretty to get you ready for the parade. But it should be fine by parade time. Now, just within the past 15 minutes, I actually did speak to city officials. They say they have 24 trucks all loaded with salt, all ready to go to start cleaning those roads at 11 p.m. to make sure that parade is as safe as possible tomorrow. Now, we'll have updates on the parade on our website. You can also find those updates on the parade's social media, as well as on Facebook, the Greater Hartford St. Patrick's Day Parade. For now, live in Hartford, Mike Cerullo, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Mike.